Hi everyone, today I wanted to share my Tim Holtz dress form um, name banner that I made for Really Reasonable Ribbon and I did use a lot of satines and ribbons and trims and laces on this and so the first thing I did was I used right here on the back that's a pink sateen with grow grain edge and so I used that and I glued each one of the dress forms with a hot glue gun to the, um, to the ribbon and so for my first dress form, I went ahead and used the the <laughs> sorry the double ruffled edge ribbon, and this is in white. And I just did two layers, so I started with the bottom one and then did the the top one. And then I just added um, some sequins flowers and some uh, feathers, sorry. And then uh, E for the beginning of her name is Evelyn. And so my second dress form right here, whoops, I'm going to make a mess. I ended up using the velvet, and I believe that was a mauve velvet that Bonnie carries. And then I went ahead and made some roses with it, and those were super easy to do with the hot glue gun. And I also used the trim, the leaves in moth, or moss. <laughs> I can't even talk. Oh, okay, and then I added a butterfly, and everything's done with the hot glue gun on these. It just makes it um, easier to do. And then my third dress, I used the white pleated sateen, and then I also used a lace, and I've listed the laces and all the ribbons below for you. And then I added some feathers, some more lace up here, and some vintage roses, and then just a regular flower. And then on this one, I went ahead and used the Noel lace and then some sateen ribbon for the roses on that. And then the dress is made out of a tulle, and then I added a butterfly on that one. Can you see that one? It's kind of hard to see. My lighting in here is really bad. So, And then on this one, I used the Silky Crush um, ribbon. And this is a white. You can see that? It's really, really pretty. And Bonnie carries um, different colors in that as well. And then I used the lace around the waist of it and then across the top. And you can see that. Oops. And then just added some flowers and a button and a flower. And the same thing down there, flowers. And then my last one, I went ahead and used some more sateen. And went ahead and just did four layers of it and I started at the top and then just worked my way down and then added the crocheted flowers and then some gems and more feathers and then a little necklace and then these are chipboard alphabets and I hot glued those on too even though they come with stickers I still went ahead and hot glued them those Anyways, and I hope you enjoyed my video. I wanted to share each one with you. Pictures, the pictures are really hard to get the color, but you can see the color now, and the, all the pinks are different on this. And thanks for stopping by, and we'll see you next time. Have a nice day.